So, John, I, I want to start with you with, um, I think, the inevitable question that the entire room wants to know. If I hold a palm pre in the lower left-hand corner, <laughs> will the call drop? Well, you know, uh, I think it'll work just fine. <laughs> but you're not, you're, it's, it's less than convincing. <laughs> well, I can tell you in due diligence. <laughs> the boss Through speaks. due diligence, yeah. it does work fine. Okay, including if you hold it in that place where the, uh, that, uh, the other guy's phone. You can hold it any way you want. There we go. There's, there's, the, there's the quote for, for the start of the conference. All right, you, you, the, the, Palm, uh, the HP acquisition of Palm is a, is a big strategic vision, and we're going we're gonna to get to that in a moment. I want to give you a lot of opportunity to talk about that. So, but let's get, let's get a little dwelling on the past out of the way, and we'll start with, we'll start with <laughs> HP. Uh, uh, Todd, when, when HP bought Compaq, and for several years after that, Compaq, or HP, actually was a leader in smartphones and had a, had a significant market share. That didn't work out so well to the point where, you know, the company's doing a reboot on smartphones with the Palm acquisition. Help, help me out here. I, I, view the, I view embracing WebOS as being, I don't know, maybe repudiation of Microsoft is too strong. I guess you'll think that's too strong. But if I'm Microsoft, I say... Um, by the way, I'm working very hard on a new version of Windows Mobile. I'd kind of like you to use that. Mm -hmm. You just spent more than a billion dollars to shun me, Mr. Microsoft. Well, I don't know. I don't know if I'd say we shun them. I, you know, we're still Microsoft's largest customer. Um, we have a deep partnership with them from from distribution to to development that you know we're very very deeply committed to. At the same time, uh, we believe WebOS gives us distinct advantages in those product sets where we'll launch it. You know, we're not, we don't see them as competitive at this point. Um, you know, as Microsoft launches um, uh, Microsoft phones, clearly we'll compete in that segment. The, you know, the reboot of Palm was a, was a, was a moonshot. It was, it was a very dynamic uh, uh, plan that you were going to build a, a new phone, a new operating system, and you were going to rejuvenate a company that had fallen on hard times. Now, it worked to the extent that you, you sold it an attractive uh, value to HP, but it, it didn't work in the sense that the plan was for Palm to regain its glory as an independent company, right? And what I want to ask you is, what, what, stood, in, what stood in the way of that happening? Well, you know, I think, I think we had a really unique opportunity in that, in that we got to start with a blank sheet of paper, which is really, really rare. And we got to develop a, a new OS for the future uh, and a new set of products. And, and, you know, we built a great team. Uh, we have a, a, a great roadmap in place. And I, I think the, the issue for us was, was we needed to get to scale. And, and I think that the market became much more competitive much more quickly than, than we had hoped or expected. Okay, that's, I think that sounds like a euphemism for the iPhone did way better than anybody, anybody expected. I, I would say both the iPhone and, you know, and frankly, Android as well. Right? And, and, and so I think the, 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 you know, our, our timing in the market was such that, that we needed to get to scale more quickly, and, and that's what really drove uh, the, the acquisition with, with HP was, was you know, putting together the scale, the the billion customers, the, you know, the capability to have that global reach, you know, along with the innovation that, that we deliver at Palm, I think is a really, really strong combination. And, and, and you know, really looking forward to, to working with Todd and, and, and with the team at HP to, to really deliver what we started out. So it was, you know, I, I, I would say it, it was more than just about the company, but it was about delivering new technology and new capabilities to, to, to the world.